Well done, Mark. Well played. <laughs> now, it's exactly 100 days till the start of the Tour de Yorkshire 2018. Plenty of time to plan your bunting or flags or bikes. Uh, the route decorations have become a real feature in the race. And I don't know about you, Ho, but actually one of my favourite parts of the race, unleashing Yorkshire's humour and creativity. Oh, yes, I love it. And leading the artistic endeavour is the Tour's official artist, Lucy Pitaway. Now, the appointment was announced today, though it's the third time the artist, who's from Richmond in North Yorkshire, has been asked to paint the Tour. The cheerful prints have proved hugely popular. So, this year, she's working on five official pictures. Cathy Killick has been to meet her. Bold, bright and cheerful, Lucy Pitaway's pictures have instant appeal. She's inspired not only by the landscapes of her native Yorkshire, but also its creatures – sheep, cows and cyclists. The paintings capture the optimism and giddiness of real scenes like these when Yorkshire showed the world how to put on a race. Anyone who's been a spectator at the Grand Depart or Tour de Yorkshire will recognise the event in the paintings. Now Lucy's working on five more images, but we can only show you teasing glimpses for now, as she has to keep them under wraps. <laughs> yeah, I think it's probably the world's worst kept secret at the moment. <laughs> Several people seem to already know. Um, but yeah, it's been quite exciting not being able to reveal it. Um, and then we have the whole build up uh, towards the event where we can release little snippets of the work and little teasers, so that'll be fun. Lucy's official pictures of the two previous tours have pulled off quite a feat, capturing a sprawling event in a single, crisp, imaginary vision. This year, by producing five works, she'll be able to reflect the separate stages with her customary feel-good style. I think in, the, in this world nowadays, there's just so much um, bad news and, and things going on in the world that aren't particularly cheerful and, and nice. You want to sort of bring the positive out of life and bring the um, energy and the colour out um, and let remi remind people of the lovely world we, we live in, really. The colours are just so uplifting, aren't they, to look at? Oh, thank you. I, I love to work with a lot of bright colour. Um, I think it's what people recognise about my work is the, the colour. It's proving a very successful approach. Lucy now employs 14 people making her art a family business. And once you know that, you can see her paintings aren't really about sheep. They're about families and their special relationships. No wonder they sell so well. Cathy Killick, BBC Look North, Brompton on Swale.